What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel here on the Torque Drift Beta in search of that perfect setup. So I have been having a lot of fun with the new update. So take a look at quickly what I've got into right now. We are rocking an E30 sit or E30 E30 with uh, some very interesting mods because I did get a Forge 2JZ out of a crate opening from the Grease Monkey Games crate. So we are rocking a Forge 2J with uh, aftermarket exhaust, the Lynx ECU, um, bigger turbo, Oop, and I went too far back, a bigger turbo, and then also a bigger clutch. We are also rocking coilovers and stuff like that. So. I am rocking 55 degrees of steering lock, 7.5 degrees of camber, tow 1.32, caster we are at 5 on for our angle mod, and then when it comes to our suspension we are rocking all the way down with 14 stiffness, which we should probably raise that up a little bit, we're, we're going to leave it at how it is. So the one thing I did want to adjust is I did want to adjust my tire profile right now because we did... Oh, you can turn down grip factor? Oh. I didn't know that was a thing. So apparently we can turn down grip factor a little bit. So we're going to turn down the grip factor of these tires just a little bit. And then we are also going to leave our brakes. We want to adjust our tire profile slightly. We're going to drop that down. Well, I want to let me move it. Oh, apparently we can't adjust profile. We can adjust our track, our pressures, but not our profile. I don't know if that's a glitch, but we can adjust the profile. So I guess we're just going to leave that all how it is. Um, but we are going to go adjust the rear um, when it comes to the tires, because I feel like when you set it in the front, it sets it in the rear. So we are rocking the uh, Nexon N5000 Pluses right now. So we are 451 torque on this E30. So I've been having a lot of fun with it, trying to throw it in, trying to you know get the physics down on this game. And it looks like we do have Cali Banks, the yard, and Hakone. We have Hakone Skyline, the yard full track, and then Speedway at Cali Banks. So, we are going to hit the speedway. We're going to run some tandems in this episode, trying to get that perfect setup. Um, I am having a lot of fun with this E30 and the way it's set up right now. Um, it's hit or miss for me right now. So, there's sometimes I'm uh, pretty much perfect on my line. There's other times where I'm uh, hitting the walls and not so perfect. And it looks like we are facing somebody with a very powerful car. So, we are still rocking the manual transmission, but... Since now we have the body kit, this is the first time I've run Cali Banks with the body kit on for downforce, so hopefully we can get a good run. Let's do that way too much. Downshift the gear. Try and somewhat salvage that, but that was actually uh, the wrong way. So we threw it a little bit too hard, but um, nonetheless, it was still a very interesting throw. We are not far off him. So he must have thrown it as hard or hit the wall, so we can get a good chase and come out with a win on top of this. There we go. 30 is very twitchy in a sense. Shade in. Run nice and high. That's how I would have liked to... Oh, no, 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 don't crash. That's how I would have liked to have run it. I was by myself, but not over-rotate. I don't have the high-angle kit yet, so that's why I'm having a little bit of trouble holding that high-angle like I want to. I don't think we won. We did win. We did. Oh, he didn't have a very good chase. So we'll take the win on that one. Sorry, my dude. GG. So, 1661. That's a huge increase. Plus 21 keys. Still haven't gotten out of the gold that he 30 just wrecked through. Still have not gotten out of bronze in these cars. I keep winning and losing. So I'm still, you know, bronze keys. Uh, what am I at? We're at level 66. I've been up at 90, dropped back down and stuff because there's been time where I was having some bad runs. So now we are here at Hakone Skyline. Um, like I said, I'm having a bit of an angle issue with this because I don't have the higher angle kits yet. 
and they're not available because the parts come in randomly. I should probably check that angle kit out here after one or two runs and see if maybe it is in the store. So we go here in Hakon in our E30. Skyline circuit. Kick that in. Oh, I thought I could thought I could get that good with a clutch kick, but clutch kick did just send me into the wall. So we did not miss the clip, so we did not like disqualify ourselves. So the driving characteristics of the game are a lot different now, so and the penalties when you tap a wall, the, the time down is a lot longer. So when you hit a wall, it takes you a lot longer before you can actually get points. He's probably going to trump me by like 60 or 70. 50, yeah, 25. So we'll try to get a good chase. Trying to still get, I think, one or two more door dives for one of the sponsorships that I've been working at. I'm surprised I don't have them all yet, but, you know, have not uh, had some really good runs. See, that would have been better. But see, the slowdown time for hitting a wall is... Does that consider a door dive? <laughs> or does that consider a bumper dive? So this guy's kind of all over the place, making me go all over the place. So uh, I don't think we're going to get a win here, so we're going to be one for one here. But the Z30 is definitely a lot of fun. I uh, haven't tried using one of these before. I was using a Miata, and the 240 came with an S15, so I figured I would try the Z30. And when I opened the crate, I was on the E30, so it gave me the motor for the E30 which was kind of sad. I should, probably should have put it in the S15 or something, but we're rocking what we got. So we're going to go to the final track, which I believe is the yard full. Hopefully we'll be able to do a good full yard run in this, and then we will go check back in the parts department and see if we got any new parts to throw on this car. Oh, I should, probably should have hit search. So today is a pretty special day. It is actually my birthday, so hopefully, maybe tonight I will be doing possibly a birthday drift bash live. If not, um, I'll be doing it here soon, but today is my birthday, so it is a, kind of a nice day. So just chilling out, you know, sending uh, send here on the torque drift. All right, so let's see how we handle the jump drift with the Z30. Trying to not throw too much angle, pedal the throttle a little bit. There we go. Not a bad way to start. We didn't throw ourselves into the wall like we always do, but we threw ourselves into a different wall. A wall that I've never hit before, and now the car does not want to move, and I have a feeling we are going to, if we don't get to this clip section, first we will disqualify ourselves because they did shorten the times for disqualification. So, unfortunately, we could have definitely beaten that. So we're definitely going to try and give that another run. Because uh, because I wrecked into that wall. I disqualified myself. We can't go in that. Because we had a very good start to that run. So we're going to try to get another one in here. Luckily, it doesn't cost us anything to go back now. Because I did change that. So, like I said, we are rocking Grease Monkey down. Or DC down. And OMG Drift sponsors right now. Trying to tag some other ones in there. Trying to get them done because of the uh, server reset but I am seeing a lot more cars and a lot more people with custom uh, custom names now so it is kind of cool to see more custom names rather than just you know, the standard um, names that are given to everybody so a lot of people are actually getting more into the game which is awesome thing because this game is so much fun when you get some uh, good tandems in so I'm gonna straighten it out a little bit so I don't smack myself into that wall so we can actually try and actually get a good run on that e-brake there we go trying to tag all these clips we are getting all those clips though put this back this way tag that clip we weren't able to transition that together that was too much angle we're gonna try clutch kick and over rotate ourselves we just need to keep going so we don't just qualify ourselves again and we are going to disqualify ourselves again. You cannot crash at all in this round. So get wrecked. Just, so the disqualification is a lot quicker now. 
I don't know if anybody else is noticing that or having issues with this whole disqualification thing, but uh, on these full tracks, it, it makes it where you pretty much have to be almost perfect. Otherwise, you get a disqualification and you do not get a chance. And apparently, I got a, a tweet from Xbox about PUBG full product release coming September 4th. PUBG full release, which I will be getting, so uh, I already have it. I just got to wait for the full release to happen, so PUBG will be hitting the channel. Let's see, do we have any upgraded parts? We do have a higher angle kit, but I don't have enough money. Can I get it? Plus 14, I do not have enough money. I need like 2,000 more. So, well, I need to work to get that angle kit done. So, and I'm trying to think of a fast way to do it other than try and... Uh, win some of the or drift some of these events so i feel like we'll hit cali banks again and see if we can't um get a good tandem lead chase and cali bank just try to get that money to get that higher angle kit so that i can get this car more dialed in for another episode here so that the car is not just washing out and throwing way too much angle where i can't even uh hold it so it is definitely different physics than the first few um, updates, but I feel that I'm getting more comfortable with this update and it makes the game so much more interesting. Throw that out there very wide, don't crash. But we have this issue of um, going too far sideways and throwing ourselves way, way off track. I think I'm just trying to go too hard. I need to back down a little bit right now because I don't have the angle. I don't have the high degree of uh, steering angle like I should. It beat him. He must have hit the wall. We rocking this team with uh, sponsor stickers all over the car. It's definitely cool to see the sponsors working again because there's a lot more custom liveries on cars and stuff like that now that the sponsors are working. I throw a better angle when I'm in chase. I don't understand why. Um, but hopefully I can actually take the win because uh, he didn't really have the chase of a run. But if he chased me in a full and got a lot of points on a chase, then he will still have a chance to beat me. And not going to happen. So we're going to take that. Not a lot of money because it was not a lot of points. So we'll try and, I guess, hit the yard one more time and see if we can't get some uh, a full run in the yard before we end this episode off. If not, I will be, I guess, uh, grinding out one of these races for uh, not many points to try and get that angle kit or wait for my sponsorship rewards and hopefully um, be able to get it and have a higher angle kit to throw this car down more sideways in a later episode stock S15 it looks like people liking my Instagram photos so hopefully we don't fail this lap because we're 0, we're 0 for 2 right now here at the yard be gentle on that throw in Kick it back. Trying to be uh, super gentle and not do that because that is going to horribly drop my frame rate lag. And uh, we got to get all the way to the end there before, and that's not going to happen. So I think we're going to cut our losses here on Torque Drift today. Maybe we'll try one more at one more race or two at the. Uh, Cali Banks run. Wow. 139,000 on a. See, I don't understand how that works. I didn't get a run, yet he got 75,000 on a chase and 139 on a lead. Huh. 215. If you guys can explain this to me, because I'm still trying to figure that out, how did that happen? How does, how does that work? How does he get that much on a disqualified run? I'm going to have to talk to the devs about that and see about that because that's it's quite interesting. Anybody else recognized or had issues where, like, for some reason, a stock car runs just the perfect, like, pro run and uh, just trumps you by hundreds of thousands of points and you don't know why? I'm not sure on that one. I'm going to have to uh, look into that one and see if I can... Uh, Maybe figure out what uh, what's transpiring with that. So we're gonna try and get a good run here, initiate sooner. 
Not as much angle. There we go. Now we're tagging. Now we're tagging clipping points. Now we got clipping points. Getting all these Instagram likes. Now we got tagging clipping points. Now we got 45,000. Now we got a good lead run. So now let's see if we can't get a good chase. Maybe get a good, a good door dive. And uh, on this E46, Indo U versus BMW right now. Check up a little bit. And I thought he was going this way. And I totally uh, threw myself totally out of this run. Because of that, I got... Uh, no, I got 490 points. So my driving today is not a... Uh, not 100%, uh, nor is it anywhere near that right now. We had a great lead, but uh, I was trying to follow him and lost my line and put us in the wall. But we still did win though. So we did still did take the win on that. So that's definitely good. We did take some money on that, 1750. We're gonna level up to 18. I know I probably should be a lot higher level, but he wants a rematch. So we're gonna tag that rematch real quick. And, uh, weed going against a weed in a z46 so this is gonna be the last one so you guys know you can follow me on facebook twitch twitter and instagram all that's found in the description box below i want to make a big thank you to all the subscribers for all your continued support i should probably shift my gears especially on this torque drift beta series having a lot of fun with it i'm missing all the clips so this is a very bad lead run so we're just gonna end it on this note so as you guys know, you guys can follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram all from in the description box below. Should be doing some uh, live Twitch feeds. He got disqualified. So we'll take the win. I guess we'll end that on a win. So until next time, guys, I was like, thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. And uh, I, was, yeah, I think my game just froze. I was trying to go to replay. Get maybe a little bit of a replay angle on this horrible run so until next time guys like thank you guys for watching i'm evil rabbit that's a pretty nice entry though better was way off the wall <laughs> i don't know